Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to subtract a rational expression with unlike denominators. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem here. We have to subtract 8y over y squared minus 16 minus 4 over y minus 4. And just like the title suggests, our denominators are unlike, not the same. So what do I do? Well, at first, just like normal fractions that we're subtracting, I want to have a common denominator. So how do I do that? Well, first thing I notice is like, yeah, they're nowhere close. But then I start thinking, well, if I can not write too much here, y squared minus 16, I can probably factor that out and maybe it's a y minus 4 times something else. So let's go do that. 8y stays in the numerator. Denominator, y squared minus 16. How can I factor that? Well, two numbers that multiply by negative 16 but add to be 0, the b value, are a plus 4 and a minus 4, right? Minus 4, plus 4. 4, negative 4, six, negative 16. Add them, get a 0. Well, the second expression, y over a y minus 4, well, we're almost there, right? y minus 4, y minus 4. What has to be added to the second equation here in the denominator to keep them the same? That's just a y plus 4. So if I'm going to do that, multiply by a y plus 4 in this denominator. But whatever we do in the denominator, we also have to do to the numerator. y plus 4, I almost wrote 4 plus 4. My 4s look like y's, bear with me. Well, we have y plus 4 over y plus 4. That's essentially a 1. And look, denominator is the same here. So now we can combine this fraction. Let's deal with a numer- oh. Actually, well, keep 8y by itself first. 8y minus here, and we're going to distribute that minus to really, if you want to do it like this, minus to 4, makes it a little easier. Negative 4 times y is a minus 4y, and then negative 4 times a 4 is a minus 16, okay? Denominator, y plus 4, and y minus 4. All right, keep on going, combine our like terms, 8y minus 4y is a 4y in the numerator, minus a 16, and don't multiply this out. Keep that right there separate factored and it might cancel. y plus 4, y minus a 4 here. Now we can keep simplifying. It's a long process. It's arduous. 4y minus 16. I'm going to pull out a 4 from both numbers. Do that. Pull out a 4. I'm left with a y minus a 4. Oh, I'm getting excited. And I have a y plus 4 here and a y minus 4 there in the denominator. Y minus fours cancel, it's beautiful. Boom, boom, what am I left with right here? Four over a Y plus four, but wait, not done. What happened when we canceled out a Y minus four, we're missing part of what this original expression had. And it told us something about what numbers we can use. We can't divide by zero. That information got removed when we canceled out the Y minus four. We know if we put a positive 4 here, right, a positive 4 in for y, that cancels out and we get a 0, right, 4 minus 4 is 0 in the denominator. So we have to say that y cannot equal a positive 4, so that information conveys to our final answer. So now, all simplified final answer, 4 over y plus 4, where y is not equal to a positive 4. Hope you learned something here on how to subtract a rational expression with unlike denominators. If you did, make sure you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.